Yep, that's the expression of a guy who just had to carry 200 pounds of maple up the stairs after lugging it around for three and a half years, moving it at least eight different times. But flashback to 2018, salvaging this chunk of wood with my perfectly adequate electric chainsaw. knocking off the paint and all the high spots, but this end grain hard maple is tough stuff. So I'm gonna use a router sled with a big beefy router bit to level the rest of this off to get it close. And then I'm gonna use robots to dial it in.
Thanks for watching. Down in the description, I have links to all the sponsors of this build, so go check those out. But I specifically want to call out Inventables, maker of the new CNC router, the X-Carve Pro. It is a beefy prosumer level CNC, a huge upgrade from the original X-Carve, both in power and in the size. I was pretty much able to max out the machine with this project right here. The slab took up most of the four x four table and all but like a 16th of the five inch gantry clearance. The X-Carve Pro is driven with some big ball screws, linear guides, has a two horsepower spindle, runs that off of VFD, so the whole thing runs off regular house power. All those nerdy details, that's available on the Inventables website. Say it with me. 
Links down below. By the way, it's no joke I've been hauling this slab of wood around for three and a half years. I salvaged a bunch of this hard maple from a tree that I'd be taking down at my grandmother's house. So that's what makes this wood so special and really gives this finished piece such a story. Actually, counting the rings on this thing dates this thing back to the late 1800s, about 130, 140 years old. It's a tree that my mother and her siblings used to climb and play in. Uh, my family tapped this thing to make maple syrup. You can actually see a bunch of scars here right on the surface of the table. That's where the maple tree was tapped and healed itself around that spot. New builds and videos coming very soon, just like this one, slowly working my way through my editing backlog. Videos detailing the garage renovation and the barn renovation, it's probably next, but follow me on social media for real-time updates on everything that's going on in both of my shops. Jackman 2 shops. It's a weird flex.